Welcome back to the My Cute Jeans YouTube channel. It's been way too long since I've uploaded on here, and I'm really sorry. Um, I don't really have a good excuse. I've just been busy with life. But I definitely want to catch up with you guys, and I plan to do a double feature this week, and hopefully a double feature next week. I can't guarantee anything. Your very first Other Ways to Be Green series episode today is going to be cloth napkins. So why use cloth napkins? Pretty much for the same reason you'd use cloth diapers. Um, you want to save money by not buying disposable napkins anymore. And you want to be good to the earth by not throwing away so much garbage. Could be one reason, could be the other, maybe both. I mean, for me, it's really, I like to save money. <laughs> um, and uh, one of the questions I like to ask people when I interview them is, has cloth diapering inspired you to be green in other ways? Because for me, it's definitely true. It definitely happened that way. I didn't even know about cloth diapering until my friend Christine, who I met on a message board, um, actually told me about cloth diapers. Uh, and then this whole other world of green stuff was opened up to me. Actually, if you want to read more about my story uh, behind how and why I started using cloth diapers and sewing cloth diapers, you can check it out on the Knicker Nappies uh, blog, uh, Featured Fluff Addict. And I definitely encourage you guys to apply for the Featured Fluff Addict because anybody can, anyone who's into cloth diapers, and it's really fun to you know reflect, answer some questions, and then get to see yourself featured on the blog. The why of why to use cloth napkins is pretty obvious, right? It's the how that we have to start questioning. And there are two ways that you could go about this. Either you can buy cloth napkins from like a big name shop online. I found some on Amazon just doing a Google search for it. Or in an Etsy shop, a small name shop. Um, I found this one on Etsy. There are a ton of different kinds. There's big ones, small ones, rectangular ones, square ones, um, ones in solid colors, ones in prints, ones for every different occasion, different fabrics, cotton, linen, flannel. The other option is to make your own. When I had the idea to start using cloth napkins, actually my mom asked me to make her a set of cloth napkins for her birthday. Um, I did some research and I, I read maybe three or four different blog posts and uh, read about the different methods there are. I, I tried the, the mitered cornered method and you can see it came out alright but I, I think it's pretty wonky looking. I wasn't really happy with it and it was kind of time consuming uh, to do this just using one layer. I mean it does save fabric but I found out that what I really like to do is a turned and top stitched with two layers of fabric and it does make your napkins a little bit thicker maybe you like that, maybe you don't but I found out that the, the mitered way is just too hard. These are the heavy linen ones that I made. I made them for special occasions so when we want to make the table look really fancy and nice um, they're 13 by 10 inch rectangles actually. I also made these ones from natural linen they're about seven by seven inch squares. Well, you can see some of them came out a little bit smaller. <laughs> uh, and my husband really likes them. He says they look like restaurant napkins. But um, it really bothers me that they wrinkle really badly when they come out of the dryer. Um, so I always find myself ironing our napkins uh, when they come out and it's just silly. So I made 10 of these plain white napkins um, from flannel and so I used the fuzzy side as the wrong side and the, the not so fuzzy side is, is actually on the outside because I wanted to make these as close to real <laughs> disposable napkins as possible for our everyday use and they came out really nice I like them and I actually used blue top stitching on these so I could distinguish them from the plain white tissues that, that I made for us that we have in our bathroom, just in case, you know, they get mixed up with each other in the wash. Uh, and then I also made these Christmas napkins. I have a whole set here. Um, actually, I made eight of them. Um, these ones have 
Oh, they're Christmas trees, by the way. And these ones have green on one side. I made four of those. And then I made four of them that have red stitching and red on the other side. Okay, so you can see that there really are a lot of different kinds of cloth napkins. Hi, baby. Here, walk with me. Walk with me over here. So you can see that cloth napkins really have an almost endless variety of shapes, textures, fabrics, colors, and prints. You can have plain, everyday napkins in flannel or linen. You can have classy, fancy napkins uh, for special occasions. You can have, even have like colorful print napkins for holidays. And these are disposable ones, which um, are really noisy <laughs> and thin, and you have to throw them away. There are just so many different kinds of cloth napkins. Thank you so much for tuning into the My Cute Jeans YouTube channel. Um, please check out my Etsy shop if you haven't yet. It's www.mycutejeans.com. That will take you to my Etsy shop. And I also have a Facebook fan page that I'm very active on. I have 90 fans right now. Thank you all so much. That's at facebook.com slash mycutejeans. And you can find me on Twitter, where I'm also very active, at twitter.com slash mycutejeans. Currently, I'm also tweeting for Etsy Cloth Diaper. Um, that's the Etsy Cloth Diapers team. Uh, oh, if you'd like to join us, uh, there is a hashtag cloth diapers chat every Monday night at 9, 9 p.m. And if you download a Twitter app like TweetDeck, that can make joining us in the Twitter chat a lot easy, and I definitely recommend checking it out. It's really fast-paced, but really a lot of fun, and it definitely gets me looking forward to my Monday night. So um, I'll see you there. Tune in again next Friday for um, a showcase of some brand new products that I'm really super excited about.